Hey everybody, Native Bear here. It's been a while, well, a month, because my vlogs always take a little longer to come in, because here in Canada, we were, I think we were a base, Canadian based company, and then they changed to US, because their dollar is worth more right now, so us Canadians gotta pay more, which is kind of stupid. I know they say 19.99 ends up being three month subscription of $85 is after currency exchange 118, which is almost not worth it. So I don't know how long I'll be keeping this up for. But we will start with um, the sci-fi block. It feels pretty heavy right now. I'm really excited. I'm hoping there's a cup in there. I have lots of cups in their block. I personally don't use them to drink coffee. <laughs> I use them. <laughs> yeah. I have a Batman Glow in Dark cup we got from last block. Not let her use it. <laughs> My Batman cup. <laughs> and a Doctor Who cup I bought myself. It's a big mug. I'm not using it because I just like collecting stuff. <laughs> and if there's a big of me, I like to collect stuff. But sometimes you use, sometimes you don't. Shirts I use more than often than other stuff. And it is pretty packed in there. And we will start with, um, it looked like a multi-pass. If you guys ever seen, um, uh, what the hell is that movie called again? The Fifth Element? He shows this to get away, get through all things. Nice. And then we have a little keychain figure from Guardians of the Galaxy. It's Rocket Rancoon with a bald head. Oh, nice. That'll add to my collection of stuff. Which, yeah, sits up there like that. And we have, ooh, a Doctor Who. Yeah, yeah. Pop. For your drinks, Slurpees, Pops, whatever you want to use it. Water. Your top, yeah, water so it doesn't get stained or ruined. That adds to my Doctor Who collection stuff. <laughs> and, oh yeah, there's the straw. <laughs> Huh. It looks like they gave us a TARDIS collector tin, sponge box. All right. That's awesome. It's on both sides. It says, please box. Yeah, yeah. Awesome. That's wonder why I still have it. There's actual cup and a fucking lunch box in there. And, um, Lilu from the Fifth Element. Oh, awesome. That was actually a good movie, even though they had certain aspects I didn't like in that movie. <laughs> oh, and there's a multi-pass sticker. Sweet. Love my stickers. Yeah. Hey. Get out of there. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Pop it. It looks like there's something from Star Wars. It's Bubba Fett. Looks like an action figure they released in, um... 90s and 80s, but not without the shooting wrist because that got banned because it was too choke hazards. But now that toy is worth thousands of dollars. It's ridiculous. Nice. And the rest of it says whatever, and now we have the shirts. All right, Rock'em Sock'em Terminators. Rock'em Sock'em Terminators, yes. That's Whoever awesome. remembers those toys from the 80s. <laughs> Rock'em Sock'em Robots, if not. You're kind of too young to be on my channel. <laughs> you remember them? Yes, they were fun. Okay, yes, in a way. But yeah. <laughs> That's the first block. But I used to do them separately, but now I don't because it's easier to steal all at once and chuck my blocks at my cats. Freak them out. <laughs> <laughs> and I recently just purchased Season 5 of Game of Thrones. I like the front cover. It's all gold, and you see Tyrion Lannister, and the dragon, he's all like, holy shit. <laughs> <laughs> and a weird movie called The Hole, I don't know if you guys have ever heard of it. It's kind of a British actor's, it's kind of, not disturbing movie, but it's uh, interesting. If you ever want to watch a weird movie, check it out. <laughs> Can't rent it because there's no goddamn, you know, blockbusters and Rogers video or whatever your local rental place was. <laughs> Those are my Canadian. <laughs> this will be my arcade block. We will start with oh, 
It looks like a little tin container from um, so there's Mario or or Zelda. I think it might be Zelda though. Does it give you a little rupee inside? Oh right, totally Zelda. Yeah, a rupee is cool. It's being a little patient, patient to come out. Oh, that's why there's tape and glue on it. Thank God, they taped and glued that. All right. Precious. But ever seen um, what's it called again? Wishmaster, the gin. Yeah. That rupee kind of reminds me of it. Oh yeah. You also got a pretty old one, that one too, and obscure because he's only theatered for about two months back in the ninety-five, no ninety-seven. <laughs> <laughs> Unnecessary facts you might need to know. <laughs> and there's a salt, super salt and pepper. All right. Arcade block exclusive. So is it like a Mario and a Luigi? It is. It is a mushroom. All and, right. And a pipe. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're thinking pipe. Don't know. <laughs> Don't think that way. But yes, there it is. <laughs> That's awesome. We had Pinky and Blinky. We still have those ones. We probably will use these ones too. <laughs> yeah. You have enough shakers around the house. <laughs> Need them everywhere. <sighs> That's a little nifty thing they sent us. This one's actually been pretty good to us. Yeah. And we will start with um, Max and Hyla tea towel. <laughs> I'm not going to open this, but if you know Hyla from The Legend of Zelda, there's a map. It's a tea towel, so it's probably going to be like this big. Nice. For your tea thing. Oh, and they sent us another cup. <laughs> All this right. This is just, just awesome. It is Sonic the Hedgehog. Aw. Now I don't know which one to steal. <laughs> has Sonic on the... Face on the one, and the head say the name on the other one. Nice. It's pretty cool. It's blinking. Um, <laughs> Allison probably will just take both of these. But that's how she rolls. I know they'll stay in the cupboard for a while before she uses them. But she'll break them up at parties because, you know, what better time to show off your shit? <laughs> <laughs> like, seriously. <laughs> dun, 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 the shirt. Oh, I think I have a sideways. <laughs> oh, it's Pokemon. Oh, yeah. Um, Charmander. Charmander and, uh, Charizard? Charmander and, and Shadow of Charizard. Char Angel. Charmeleon. Yeah, it's all three of them. Yeah. No, oh, that's pretty cool. And it looks like there's still something missing. there. Oh, the, the Bit Trip Collection. Eight game collection of award winning Bit Trip series. It looks like a little... Yeah, it's... This game's... It's like, um... I guess, I don't know, kind of retro games, but not. People make these and just like emulators and stuff. Add to computer if you want. Usually when I get these, they just sit in a big pile and add to my collection of stuff I don't use. <laughs> <laughs> and I think that is it. This was an actually good month for Nerd Block. You sometimes you usually get one bad block and it's like, eh. And sometimes it is a classic block because it's like meh, they try to mix everything in there. That's why I separated their sci-fi and their K block because I like both those. <laughs> <laughs> Until next time. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>